Hello everybody, welcome back. Today we have a very niche kind of tutorial for people that want to not have an arrow on desktop shortcuts. Now these look like they're applications, but they're not. They're actually normal desktop shortcuts. I've just done something to get rid of the little arrow in the bottom left hand corner that shows you that it's a desktop shortcut and not the application itself. So how do we get rid of those shortcuts? Because maybe you want a nice clean desktop icon like I do. So we're going to go to registry editor. So go to registry editor and then click yes that was a little thing there saying they would don't want to make changes so what we're gonna do is in the registry editor we're gonna to go to h key local machine then go to software then go to microsoft and sorry if this is too small for you guys expand your screens and i'll also have this this uh this path in the description down below so in microsoft and in, in microsoft you're gonna look for windows so we go to windows and then under windows we go to current version and then under current version, we're going to go to explore, I believe. Uh, where is it? Uh, here, let me uh, do this. Should be explore. Here we are, explore. Now in explore, what we're going to do is we're going to create a new registry that basically makes it so this arrow points somewhere else. So what we're going to do is going to right click, we're going to click new, and we're going to do key. What we're going to call that key, it's actually going to be called shell icons. So I renamed it already, and you can probably see right here if you can see my screen, shell icons. Um, so I basically create that new thing, and then I'm going to create this all over again, this little 20, this number 29. So we're going to create new, and we're going to go to string value. And then string value we're going to put as 29, and of course it already exists, so we can't really do that. And then what we do is we double click on that, and we're going to input these this value, which I'll put down below as well. It's percent winder percent. Uh, is that a forward slash or a backslash? I think it's a backslash system 32 backslash 32 or shell 32 dot DLL comma negative 50. That is what you do. And then you do a system restart or log off and log back on and it will reset it. So you do not have to see the arrow on your desktop icons. Now this only works for 100% scaling. If I scaled up, like if I go to display settings and scaled up my uh, display to like 200%, so like things are bigger, it would not work. It would probably be a little black box in the bottom and because it's pointing to something that actually kind of overwrites that and looks weird. So you'll have to figure that out for yourself, but that's how you do it. Um, hopefully this helps somebody because this is going to be a tutorial for myself in the future. And yeah, thanks. Bye. Like and subscribe. I like these kind of weird, stupid things, but see ya. Bye.